guys, my name is Bethany and this is A Faye in the Life. Today I'm going to be making baked oatmeal muffins. This is a great breakfast option that you can make ahead for the week. I usually have my overnight oats almost every day for breakfast, but sometimes it's nice to have a change. This recipe makes 12 oatmeal muffins. Each one is only two WW personal points. If you have oats as a zero point food, the points value could be lower for you. In today's recipe, I did use a monk fruit sweetener. However, there is also a golden version, which is a substitute for brown sugar. Both are excellent in this recipe. You could even substitute in mashed ripe bananas and give it kind of a banana bread flavor. These muffins are super easy to make and very filling. I love to have them in the morning warmed up for a few seconds in the microwave with a little bit of spray margarine on top. You could even use a sugar-free jelly or jam and that would also be delicious. I have my oven preheated to 350 degrees, so let's get baking. The recipe is listed down below, but here's what you'll need three cups of old-fashioned oats, two large eggs, half a cup of unsweetened applesauce, one cup of artificial sweetener. You could use a white sugar substitute or a brown sugar substitute. Two teaspoons of baking powder, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, one teaspoon of almond extract, and one cup of unsweetened almond milk. You could also use a non-fat milk or other dairy alternative here. Go ahead and preheat your oven to 350 degrees and grease your muffin tin or use cupcake liners sprayed with non-stick spray. Grab a large mixing bowl and combine all of your ingredients. Mix well, and then portion out evenly into the muffin tin. You're going to bake these muffins for approximately 30 minutes. Remove from oven and cool in the muffin tin for five minutes before removing to a cooling rack. Cool completely and store in the fridge in an airtight container for up to two weeks. I hope that you give these baked oatmeal muffins a try for yourself. Trust me, you'll love them. The great thing about these muffins is since the recipe makes 12, I have enough for the week and then some. Comment down below if you've made this recipe and don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel for more recipe videos like this one. Thanks for stopping by today and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.